Hi everybody, thanks for joining me. Uh, today we're going to be doing a review on this. This is a Mackerson's Milk Stout. Um, I was surprised when I saw this on a, a supermarket shelf. I got this from Morrison's, I paid 59p for it. it. Obviously comes in packs of four, I think. I think for a pack of four you can pay three quid. It'd come loose. It's always worth in your supermarkets just checking the black clearance section. Because they usually have some beers in there and they do they, they are a lot cheaper um but this is one of the first probably milk stouts ever out there it's 2.8 percent um it used to be when i was a nipper uh, my grandma always used to drink at Mackerson, so i'm just going to crack this open. um and it used to be th uh, three percent and probably and so i'm going back to the 70s there before that it was probably it, it might have been a little bit higher but it's been passed from pillar to post, ownership to ownership. It's now owned by InBev and they've decided to reduce it to 2.8%. There's probably some tax reasons, there's savings on ingredients, I'm sure it is. I'm sure there is. But once, I'm just amazed it, it's still available. I didn't think you could get this stuff anymore. Always used to be the old woman's drink. Sorry, Grandma, you're looking down, but you were an old woman. Um, yeah, so like I say, it's Mackerson's, it's been around forever. Um, it's a milk stout, it has got lactose in it. I think back in the day, they used to advertise this as being good for you. Um, I don't really, the, the front of it, the can design itself is relatively simple. You got what I think is a milk churn on the front to show it is um, a milk stout. I think it was the first, I'm sure it's the first time milk stout. I'm sure that they devised a way of getting milk into a stout to, to turn it into a kind of milk stout we have today. Anyway, what do we have here? That has pulled black. There is a little bit of light getting through it, but not a massive amount. It's got a small tan head and there's still a little bit of carbonation happening in there, but not a great deal. So it smells that, shall we? It's sweet, it is sweet, getting brown sugar, coffee, then some sweet chocolate. Yeah, so it's stout like in, in that you've got the, the sweetness in there, you've got the coffee in there, you've got the chocolate in there, so it's very much stout like from that perspective. Let's see what it tastes like, shall we? Cheers, everybody. The coffee notes are in there, there's some roasted malts in there, there is a, a little bit of sweetness but not a great deal. Yeah it's a straight, when it's in your mouth you feel these flavours and then you swallow and there's a little bit of bitterness there, just a little bit of subtle, subtle bitterness at the back end but apart from that there's no flavour left. It is a very thin drink. There's no substance to it at all. And it is sweet, but not too sweet. The taste reminds me of, um, so it's got the coffee in there and there is a milkiness to it, but not, not a lot of milkiness. It's almost as if somebody's made a coffee and just put a dash of milk in there. That, that's kind of almost what it feels like. But that's it. That's it, a little bit malty bitterness. It's inoffensive, I suppose.
Yeah, it's a bit meh, really. Um, I always thought, when I was growing up, I just always thought this was a big, stouty drink. Just always got that impression that it was a really rich, full-on flavour drink, which not, which has surprised me, if I'm being honest. Um, yeah, uh, look, it's, it's a three out of ten. It's a three out of ten. Um, I, I can't score it any higher than that. There's, there's really no substance to it. I finished drinking it. I have got bitterness left in my mouth, but that's it. When there's nothing there to say, I've had a decent stout. <coughs> Excuse me. So yeah, three out of ten. Um, thumbs up if you like the video. Um, subscribe for daily beer reviews and let me know in the comments below what you thought of this, if you've had this before. Or if your grandma had it, what did she think to it? Cheers everybody.